Infrastructure is a big topic. Uh, we've chosen at SALC to somewhat limit our conversation to uh, those areas of energy, communications, water, and of course transportation. So SALC certainly sees the direct connection between our economic uh, prosperity, economic development, and our infrastructure, both quality and quantity. As a result, we've established a number of partnerships throughout the community, including uh, the Business Partners for Trade and Transportation, which is a group of over 20 local, uh, mostly business groups, but uh, some governmental as well, who come together to uh, keep an eye on uh, each other's priorities, to try to uh, help each other with uh, any projects that we may have coming up, as well as to just be informed about what's happening throughout the community. Uh, another is the uh, Tucson Regional Water Coalition, a group of um, water interests that get together uh, on a regular basis uh, under SALC's leadership to uh, examine issues of the day and help to uh, regulate, help to uh, help our regulators understand uh, the types of uh, issues that affect business. One of the very most impactful efforts that SALC uh, has uh, worked on over the past 10 or 12 years was the original RTA in 2006. Uh, this uh, helped us understand that the road forward in our community to success, particularly in infrastructure issues, has to do with our ability to collaborate uh, for SALC to lead uh, to follow, to support, in any case, uh, to be part of uh, collaborations within the community. The RTA will sunset uh, in two 2026, so just uh, a few short years, eight years from now. Uh, and during that time, uh, we will uh, need to do a lot more outreach to the community to let them know how successful uh, the first RTA has been uh, in order to create a new regional transportation plan which very well may include some new uh, items in it, things like maintenance of our roadways. Uh, and then finally to conduct a uh, robust public outreach toward the uh, eventual and the eventual campaign to ratify an extension of the RTA. Perhaps even an expansion of it if we're successful in uh, doing that with the legislature. Throughout all of those uh, areas of preparation for the next RTA, SALC will have a direct and uh, front row uh, view and role in uh, seeing its success.